Lon Penavai, Penavai Lane, one of the most desirable addresses to live in Carmarthenshire. A house or a plot of land here would set you back a small fortune, and that is in no part due to the outstanding views of the Gower Peninsula. I'm standing at the Bryn Mavis estate in Llanelli and behind me here is a sign saying major new development of affordable homes for sale to local people coming to this site. That's been a prospect for quite a number of years now, but there have been a number of delays to that development. This is the Bryn Mavis or Mine Gwyn Community Hall owned by the Rural Council in Llanelli and local residents told us they've been asking for more than two years for the grass to be cut here and the missing tiles you can see on the roof there to be replaced. A day after the Herald reported on the abandoned residents of this estate, the council have come back and cut the grass but the tiles remain. A tale of two properties, one where the owner tends the home lovingly inside and out and the other where the owner leaves it go to rack and ruin. The irony here is that the owner of this property is Carmarthenshire County Council. Carmarthenshire County Council have got their own policies and their own enforcement procedures for landlords who own properties similar to these in the Bryn Mavis estate that fall into disrepair and go to rack and ruin. Carmarthenshire County Council are the landlords of these properties. Just behind me here are the last remaining residents on the Bryn Mavis estate who happen to be an elderly couple and this pavement here is the route to their home. These properties had grant funding in the early 80s but the council at that time didn't give that funding until the late 90s. By that time these homes were empty and remained so turning into these abandoned empty shells. Plans to develop the Bryn Mavis estate were put on hold, mainly because of the discovery of bats in the abandoned homes, but also because there are still residents living on the estate. We are only a stone's throw from Penavai Lane, where land and homes will cost you a small fortune, but yet these residents were only offered a paltry £30,000 by the developers. In an attempt to draw the bats away from the existing homes on the Bryn Mavis estate, the council have had this bat out house built at quite a great expense, some estimates in the region of £60,000 plus. The remaining residents on the Bryn Mavis estate may feel justified in their belief that they've been neglected and abandoned by Carmarthenshire County Council. This estate has become a mecca for illegal dumping, for people stripping the properties of lead and tiles and for setting them on fire.